Yeah. Mm -hmm. What we're doing is we're taking a very sparse brow where she has overexposure. If we turn her head to the side, lift your brows for me. See how we have overexposure of the fleshy part of mm -hmm. the face that's above or sitting on top of the brow bone because there's a field of hairs here that we want to grow back. They're sparse, they're tiny, but I think if we get more of those to come back in, her brow is gonna be more conducive and complementary. Lift your brows again to her brow bones anatomy. We want to let more light into this area of the brow and less light up here. Because it looks more natural, it looks more feminine, it looks softer. As we've done over here, I've shaded the brow in with just powder in some of that very light area that we see here. Lift your brows again. Notice how much less light is able to enter that area of her brow than here. Lift again. See all that light? Mm -hmm. Not so much over here because we've shaded it off, we've blocked it off. We've created more height in her arch, which I think is giving her an, a really much more complimentary shade. Going deeper in here with the shading. Because like we said before, the appearance of height is accentuated when something else is lowered. So we lower here. We give her more drama. We make her continuum what my hand just did there versus more open. Notice how we opened up the brow bone here and the light can hit it differently. Notice how more prominent her actual crease appears here because we're working with the way her eye socket forms. We're working with the way the, her natural hairs actually grow over the skin above the brow bone. When we accent that just right, we accent everything else. This eye, the whole eye looks better. Her cheekbone looks more, higher. Mm -hmm. it looks higher, it's, it's higher, it's, it's the lift. Mm -hmm. It's the beauty makeup accentuation. It's always about the lift. That's why every facial surgery years ago was called a facelift, but everything wasn't a facelift, but it was about lifting and making the features appear uh, to set up making the cheekbone higher, making the eyelids look lifted. It's a more youthful effect when you see the eyelid lifted here. Giving a little bit of a lift here to remove the line. a line that might be there. All of that. 